Breaking Free A Journey from Virtual Reality Addiction to Real, Life Triumph It was a world within a world, a realm that blurred the lines between reality and fantasy. The virtual reality, VR, experience had become a way of life for Daniel, a young man in his early twenties. He was once a promising college student with dreams of a bright future, but the allure of VR had consumed him, taking him on a roller coaster ride of addiction and consequences. The Dawn of a New Addiction The first time Daniel donned a VR headset, he was captivated by the immersive experience. The sensation of leaving behind the mundane world and entering a realm of endless possibilities was intoxicating. The virtual landscapes, the adrenaline, pumping games, and the endless social interactions all beckoned him. He started spending more and more time in VR, neglecting his studies and relationships. As the months went by, Daniel's life outside of VR began to deteriorate. His grades plummeted, and he lost touch with friends and family. The real world became a place of inconvenience, a waiting room between VR sessions. His apartment descended into chaos, and personal hygiene became a distant memory. The consequences of his virtual addiction soon caught up with Daniel. He was expelled from college, and his parents, deeply concerned, confronted him. But Daniel's mind was still trapped in VR, and he dismissed their concerns, believing that the virtual world was his true home. One day, while engrossed in a marathon VR session, a sharp pain shot through Daniel's chest. Panic set in as he realized that his physical health was deteriorating rapidly. He had neglected his body to the point of endangering his life. This was his wake-up call, a stark reminder of the real, life consequences of his virtual addiction. The Turning Point Determined to break free from the grip of VR, Daniel made a courageous decision. He removed the headset, uninstalled all VR applications, and reached out for help. He knew he couldn't overcome this addiction alone, and his journey towards recovery began. Daniel joined a support group for virtual reality addicts, where he met others who had faced similar struggles. They shared their experiences, provided encouragement, and held each other accountable. With their support, Daniel found strength he didn't know he possessed. Recovery wasn't easy, but Daniel was determined to rebuild his life. He rekindled old friendships, made amends with his family, and focused on regaining his physical and mental health. Each day was a small step towards the real world. During his rehabilitation, Daniel rediscovered his love for art. He had been a talented artist before VR took over his life, and he decided to pursue his passion once again. Art became his therapy, allowing him to express his emotions and channel his energies in a positive direction. As Daniel continued to heal, he began to reflect on his addiction and its root causes. He realized that he had turned to VR as a means of escape, to avoid the challenges and insecurities of the real world. With the help of therapy, he confronted his demons and developed healthier coping mechanisms. The Road to Redemption Daniel's journey was far from over. He applied to community college to continue his education, working diligently to rebuild his academic future. With the unwavering support of his family, he aimed to earn back their trust and make amends for the years lost to addiction. As Daniel progressed in his recovery, 
he developed a new perspective on technology. He understood that technology, including VR, could be a powerful tool for good, but it required balance and responsibility. He started volunteering at local schools to raise awareness about the dangers of technology addiction and promote its responsible use. With determination, hard work, and newfound purpose, Daniel graduated from community college and was accepted into a prestigious art school. He embraced the real world with open arms, cherishing every moment and every relationship. Daniel's story of transformation inspired many. He became an advocate for those struggling with technology addiction, delivering motivational speeches and sharing his journey with others. He reminded them that recovery was possible, and they could find their way back to the real world. The journey continues. As Daniel embraced his second chance at life, he knew that his journey was ongoing. He continued to pursue his dreams, nurtured his relationships, and remained vigilant about his technology use. His past addiction was a painful chapter in his life, but it had also shaped him into a resilient, compassionate, and empathetic individual. Daniel's story is a testament to the triumph of the human spirit over adversity. He had faced the darkest depths of virtual reality addiction, but he emerged on the other side as a stronger, wiser, and more compassionate person. His journey from addiction to recovery was a source of inspiration for those who had similarly lost themselves in the digital world. In the end, Breaking Free, a journey from virtual reality addiction to real, life triumph, is a story of redemption and resilience, a reminder that it's never too late to break free from the chains of addiction and re-embrace the beauty of the real world. Thank you so much for watching this video till the end. Please hit the like button if you like this video and hit the subscribe button to learn English through watching these kinds of interesting stories daily. Please click on the screen on any video showing on your screen to watch it next. Once again, thank you so much for watching this video till the end.